group. And me being, well, I'm kind of called the old head now in the group. Uh, it kind of is just something that's been passed along. Uh, me being here as long as I have. I've kind of seen guys like DJ Howard, CJ Davis, and Zach Brooks, Wayne, uh, Tyshawn, all of them. Like, the older you get, the more responsibility, the more uh, leadership you take. And it's, it doesn't have to work that way, but it's just kind of something that I kind of adapted. Uh, I kind of realized that my knowledge, I've been around longer. I can share and bring them along. It's share what I know. We all work together, but it's kind of just me, us sharing and collaborating on telling us what we know, what we see. And at the end of the day, it's going to make us all better as a unit and as individual players. Some, some guys want to take the easy way out and say, hey, I'm just going to transfer and go find playing time elsewhere. Did you mm -hmm. consider that? Yes, sir, I definitely did. But uh, talking with my family and uh, just praying about it, yeah, we decided it was the best thing for me to probably stay here and uh, just finish my education, uh, working on the Masters. So, uh, and then the opportunity here is, it's, uh, it's been a great opportunity. It's been a great experience for me. So I uh, figured it would be best not just give that up and just uh, go take that risk somewhere else. It's interesting that you bring up Wayne. Do you ever go back to that game at Boston College? You were the starter. Wayne was behind you. Now he's going to be two years at the NFL. <laughs> I mean, do you ever think back what if, maybe? Uh, yes, sir. I would be lying if I said I didn't. But at the end of the day, I know it's all in God's plan. And, uh, I trust him. So whatever happens is meant to happen. And I just got to take it, learn.